Hey guys, what's going on? Nivens here. Time for your weekly rock wind-up. Well, the Grammy nominations were announced this week, and some of them are kind of confusing. Best Metal Performance, Baroness, Gojira, Korn, Megadeth, Periphery. All right, okay, no problem. Then you get to Best Rock Performance, where you've got Beyonce featuring Jack White going up against Disturbed and The Sound of Silence. Best Rock Song, only one that really stands out for us would be Metallica. Best Rock Album, Gojira, I guess, against Pan Panic at the Disco? Anyway. It's the Grammys. It happens February 12th. Who cares? Well, a uh, rest in peace again, 2016, taking another musician from us, Greg Lake. Of course, he was part of Emerson, Lake, and Palmer. Before that came King Crimson. He passed away this week uh, after battling cancer. He was 69. Well, fans of the Jesus and Mary chain are re rejoicing as they're going to get a new album the first time in 18 years. It'll be out on March 24th. Uh, they've actually got a, for, uh, a song that's already been uh, uh, uploaded, been promoted, Amputation, that uh, showed up on BBC Music this week. But uh, if you're a fan of those guys, again, be on the lookout on March 24th. And there is a lot going on in terms of world of, of uh, concerts this weekend and beginning part of next week. Quiet Riot, Kansas Hall, that's tomorrow night, Saturday evening. Jackal, of course, on, uh, on Sunday at the Midland. Jason Bonham's Led Zeppelin experience over there at uh, uh, the Uptown on Monday. And then Helmet and Local H at the Record Bar on Tuesday. Get your livers ready. They are evil. They must be punished. I'm Nivens. Thanks so much for tuning into your weekly rock windup. Have a great weekend.